Annapurna, Taoiseach, many individuals and families are struggling to cope with the cost of living increases, but some are especially heavily burdened. Included in that group are families supporting and caring for a person with disabilities. Yesterday, Family Carers Ireland launched a report compiled by the Vincentian Partnership, which detailed the extra costs to a family caring for an adolescent with a profound intellectual disability. That extra cost is already over €160 Euro per week, and the rising cost of living adds to that. So I'm asking, would you consider taking some short-term measures such as an extension of the fuel allowance for a number of weeks or, crucially, making carers' allowance a qualifying payment for the fuel allowance. Also, Taoiseach, I'm asking specifically that in the next budget there would be tax measures put in place to support families who care and, in particular, that deaf people and their families would be considered for new tax credits and measures. Thanks very much, Deputy, for, for, for raising what is, a, what is a very fair issue. Uh, and as you know, we have increased the, the fuel allowance now over the last 18 months, more by from about 600 and odd to over 1,000. And then we've added the 200 euros of the electricity cut, which will also apply. Uh, the, the cost of disability report um, has been referred to the National Disability. Sorry, Minister Rabbit, I think, is chairing um, that. Um, um, process um, in terms of now um, relating that to, to, to policy in terms of uh, people with disabilities in particular and the additional costs that they face over and above normal costs and in this environment those are severe and as I said earlier in the House we're looking for a broad-based response uh, to all of these issues to help people.